Hey guys, today I am going to talk about Argos Anonymous. Uh, he has been MIA for at least three months now. Closer to four months, I believe. He did a live stream about Arcane, which he has his own promo. And then he hasn't uh, made a video after that. In fact, let me... So outside of his live stream, which was streamed three months ago, he has not made a video. Well, three months. So he's been gone for three months. I'm going to read you the video titles of from most recent until older. Dead MetaZoo just sent me something weird. MetaZoo takeover update. We got raided. MetaZoo Black Friday disclosure unpacked. MetaZoo deletes closure announcement. Why? MetaZoo is now dead for the 50th time. Dragons and waifus and magic in the otterverse. What's happening in the MetaZoo market? The biggest MetaZoo rumor right now. Sell or keep MTG Naruto MetaZoo. MetaZoo announces new artists. MetaZoo must do these two things. New MetaZoo Secrets reveals best trading card game ever. That turned out to be false. MetaZoo Kuromi news that may trigger you. And he's got uh, these thumbnails of Kuromi breaking records like in a positive way. MetaZoo just spoke for the last time. MetaZoo Christmas Rose vs. Sam vs. Adam. Two huge wins for MetaZoo hit just in time. And then my favorite video, uh, the one of the only videos I really care about in this particular video, Toxic People in MetaZoo, Pokemon, and everywhere else. So we're going to talk a little bit about the toxicity, right, against MetaZoo. It's currently in bankruptcy. It's not only in bankruptcy. It's so bad it can't even get to bankruptcy. Like a judge can't even decide what to do with it. A trustee can't even decide what to do with it because... The Mike Waddell character does not has not kept his finances in books. So they have delayed the proceedings because Mike does not have access to the accounting information that would be necessary to file for bankruptcy, right? What is happening there, who knows, but it definitely isn't good. When you're not able to understand who you owe money to, who owes you money, then what the hell has this been about? This is what a business, a business with no books is just gonna, IRS is all over this, I would assume, right? MetaZoo evolves with cryptic class online, the truth about MetaZoo's former apology in 2024, markets collapse and game stores go bankrupt, first MetaZoo eBay. So he was posting really, really consistently um, about this. Behind the scenes with 5,000 MetaZoo Kuromi Hello Kitty. I can't believe MetaZoo did this. First Kuromi Cryptid Carnival. So he was still having a really, really great time. On uh, He was still having a great time during the Kuromi thing. I think there was positivity and uh, renewed hope that Kuromi would be the set to take it to the moon. MetaZoo Spooky Halloween Pack. New MetaZoo Secrets Revealed. MetaZoo scammers are back. I don't know what they're scamming about, right? MetaZoo reschedules Caster Cup to improve access. Okay, this Caster Cup thing, which they didn't get paid out. I don't know, was it a Dark Tower or a Caster Cup? Who knows? MetaZoo client, online game client is here. Okay, that's interesting. $50,000 MetaZoo Flame Tower exclusive promo spoiler. Okay. Spoiled. MetaZoo fan gets annihilated buying eBay loot box. You made a huge mistake comparing Pokemon to MetaZoo. What is the MetaZoo Legacy set? Yikes. I, I don't I think Nick Nick Strength and Pokemon talks about Legacy. And uh, I don't think they got it, right? MetaZoo Meta targets Tarot Blisters versus OG eBay Seance. That uh, is a very big word. Oh, he's doing My Hero Academia. Uh, Disaster Strikes, MetaZoo Bear Walker. So let's go native gala box. MetaZoo Madman opens a stack of $1,000 30th anniversary packs. Will second wave MetaZoo native be enough? Yep, it turned out it was enough. And here's the Arby's promo. And then the Topps Chrome. So he was uh, really into that Topps Chrome. 
So MetaZoo is finally come to this. This MetaZoo abomination is not supposed to exist, uh, so on and so forth, right? So I think at the end of the day, he definitely was heavily invested in MetaZoo. Now, how much inventory did he have? Alpha Investment said he had a million dollars worth, right? Um, yeah, so people say haters got to hate. Um, can people make fun of me or question why I continue? Oh, yeah. And then this is uh, the discussion about my channel, which is always fun. Um, at the end of the day, I was right. The company went bankrupt. The company is so in, it was so poorly run as a business that it couldn't even, it went, entered bankruptcy, but to do so, it had to fundraise, right? Just like a Kickstarter, right? They had to go on whatnot and sell original pieces of artwork to raise money to file for bankruptcy, right? It, it, that's not a good sign, guys, that you had to raise money to file. So it, it's very interesting. The player base raised money by buying these original artworks from Shaw and Mike Waddell. Then Mike Waddell used that money to file for bankruptcy. Probably some of these people who bought original artwork, I assume they have pre-orders that have been outstanding. And it, it's, it's almost like they went against themselves, right? They paid for Mike to hire a lawyer to go for bankruptcy so then they don't have to pay anyone, including the people who are owed product. There are players owed money, there are customers owed product. This doesn't get much worse than that. And when they're like, the court, the judge is like, okay, turn over your books. Mike would doubt, I don't got no books. That's Shaw, that's, uh, no, it wasn't Shaw, it was uh, Bailey who sold the things. So Bailey and Mike are on the same side. Shaw's on a different side because he wants to sell. And it's just kind of a mess, really. It's, it's a big mess. And I don't know if Argos was in on it. I don't know if he was not in on it. But it's interesting he hasn't made an update video. Just like I said, if I'm going to criticize Alpha Investment for not making an update video, well, this guy went much harder. His whole channel, 90% of it is MetaZoo. He went a much harder than in terms of like time live streaming than uh, even Alpha Investment. So I had to ask, where is Argos Anonymous? Like, where is he, right? He sold this product, he promoted the product until Hello Kitty, until the very bitter end, I would say. You know, he was still trying to sell the Hello Kitty stuff, even though, um, you know, Bailey, the guy doesn't like Argos and they talk and, and stuff and you know, I'm sure that you're busy. Hey, I'm I'm busy. I'm down to one video a day, right? My girlfriend is pregnant. She's seven months pregnant with our daughter, Farina. And we had to do a lot of classes, a lot of meeting. We had to drive to the hospital to do a hospital tour tomorrow. Uh, that includes lunch. <laughs> and I'm busy, but like you got eight minutes to make a video, dude. You got eight minutes, nine minutes to make a video. Everyone does, right? You got some quiet time to make you know, a, a, an update video. Like a lot of things have changed in MetaZoo. Do you still believe in it? I remember um, there was all these haters and so on, but the haters were right. Uh, let me play this way. A successful business does not file for bankruptcy. Okay? And it doesn't need to raise money to hire a lawyer to file for bankruptcy. A successful business has its books in order. This is nothing that MetaZoo has done. That it indicates to me that this is a successful business. And if the business is not successful, how, how can a card game be? Yep. Anyway, bye guys.